Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Noah Factory, GTCEU Harbor. Alright, so here we are today at episode 108. I do apologize, it's been a while since I put up the video. I've just been distracted by life, work, and everything else. Okay, so I think last episode we were working on our sterile clean room, which we were all doing that in an effort to get... Um, Mutagen, as well as the raw growth medium, because we're going to be needing a lot of that going forward, especially when it comes to making, um, I want to say, like ZPM and UV machines and circuits, especially uh, wetware. Uh, do do yeah, wetware right here. Um. Well, yeah, for this, for the circuit board, for, of course, we're going to need the uh, sterilized growth medium, which that comes from just heating up the raw growth medium, of course. Okay, so uh, between episodes, I really haven't done much. I only added this one machine here, which it is making our enriched bacterial sludge. Wait, what the? Oh, my goodness. Every time it does it, I need to figure out why it's disconnecting. There we go. Isn't this chunk loaded? Yeah, it should be. Okay, so now we should have... Yeah, there we go. Californium is in there. So, I know we set up... I think we did set up a reactor to process Californium, or at least to make the Californium byproducts. So, we should have quite a bit of uh, 252. 52? There we go. Yeah, okay. Do we have any more 64K cells? I'm gonna have to... Yeah, okay. I think we're fine on storage for right now, but... Uh, I will need to figure out if I need to put any large amounts of items into their own storage cells or whatever. I mean, uh, storage uh, tanks or whatever. All right, so not much is going on here. I mean, we have input of bacterial sludge and the output of enriched, right? So that leaves us just the two spaces that we need in the machine to handle the emitter and the item in. Okay, so... With the bacterial sludge, the enriched bacterial sludge, that is, now we need to make the distillery, and then we'll get our mutagen, okay? Did I? I don't think I made a distillery in preparation. Did I? No. Okay, so while that cooks, let's see, agar. We got quite a bit of agar. I think we're good to make, what was it, the raw growth medium? Yeah, raw growth medium. Salt, ooh. Salts. Oh, that's right. I didn't figure out my salt situation. Honestly, though, what I should, what I might just do, well, I don't know if I can just outright take away the salt going to all my other machines or not. I'll have to think about that. Uh, you know what? I'll just go up and put this up here. Why not? Okay. So we need to figure out what we need to do here. So I need to obviously put the fluid in there. Regulator. Okay, so we have input and I guess output on the bottom, right? I mean, that makes sense. If I can get under there. All right. That should work. Then I'll just be able to uh, emit from the front. So if I grab an interface here, do, 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 do. I need two of those, of course. Boom, and boom, and then boom, boom, boom. All right, so in here, we need the enriched bacterial sludge. Oh, and we need to, boom. What is making the noise? Oh, here we go. Okay, so that's, now we need, what was it, the one or two? One. Actually, wait a minute. No, okay, never mind. We don't have the uh, the ghost item circuit yet. We will once we update, but I'm just kind of waiting for it to... I'm kind of waiting for um, 1.6.1 to get updated and to release. Okay, so now we have the mutagen. And we're going to want to output that. I don't think we have a tank for it yet, right? No, okay. 
So let's go get a tank. Tank. And we are going to need a boost. Do we have the mid tank yet? Did it make? Oh, there it is. Oh, uh, where is it? Healy? Oh, there it is. Okay. And the boost. The boost? Where's the boost? Okay, so with the interface, let's click the fluid in there. And before we do anything else, we're going to control this baby. And I'll just go ahead and make 16 because why not? And boom. Better. Honestly, the controller is one of those things I should just put on my auto stock system. No, not that. Uh, gen. You to gen. So we're gonna need mutagen for something. Uh, what was that something? Oh, right, the raw growth medium. And to a degree, we could also use it for this, but I think we agree, or I agree anyway, that the bacterial sludge and the mutagen are basically the same process. Yeah, it is. Okay, anyway. Um, right, so that's gonna be cooking. So let's go back up to our home and then we're gonna put down this tank and get on to making the raw growth medium. Okay, so before I look that up, there we go. And I don't need to worry about that because I'm not gonna get anywhere near max con the max value of um, the fluid. You know, I swear, swore, swear, I swear that I made a recipe for this, but I guess not. I don't know if it's worth making a whole machine for it. But there we go. Mutagen. Okay. That's probably not going to be the only um, thumbnail. All right. So we want to get the mixer now, right? And that's going to take 60 seconds, even an ivy. I mean, I guess that's fine. Maybe at some point we'll upgrade this when we have a lot of power coming our way, but uh, yeah. Speaking of power though, at some point I need to upgrade from helium plasma to a different plasma, I think. Plasma. I think I agree that, was it nickel plasma was next? So let's see, helium plasma gets, so nickel plasma gives four times the total energy output and four times as much time to burn, right? The oxygen plasma is gonna be helium three and carbon, not typically too hard, iron plasma. That is more power but slightly better duration. I think what was it the what was the big one that was nice? Was it nitrogen plasma? I think it is just nickel plasma. So oxygen, then nickel plasma would be good. Potassium for you still need a mark three for that one. So I think we're stuck right now at looking at Oxygen plasma. I mean, it's just more efficient, really, than anything. I don't think there's a bigger turbine. Yeah, I think it's just... Um, turbine holder? No, turbine... No, uh, rotor holder. Uh, so technically, there is a ZPM holder. And a UV holder. Yeah, maybe we'll do a, a, a like a like a Z was it ZPM holder when we're going with um was it oxygen plasma? Okay, back to what I was doing here. Okay, so we're gonna get a robot arm, and we're gonna need to get a filter.
Filter. Okay. So boom. Got my screw driver at. There we go. Okay, so raw growth medium. We're gonna need agar, calcium, mince meat, and salt. Agar. Calcium. I've got a lot of calcium, tiny dust. Uh, mince meat. No, it's not mince meat. Mince. And then we're gonna need salt. I need to figure out how I'm gonna handle that. Um, import, keep exact. Okay. Nice. Okay, so, boom. I guess I'll just put this on a big giant priority and request salt missions. Okay, so not only that, we also gonna need to get the mutagen in there. So let's see. What I could do is grab another interface. I need buckets. Uh, book it. Okay, iron plate. I really need to get this automated. Hammer, hammer, there's a hammer. Uh, shit, I need my, my hammer back. Okay. Base. There it is. Okay. Oh. Okay. So that's what there. There we go. And now we need to get. Okay. Conduit. Good. Okay, so we need to get Emmy Conduit. I think this will work. Still in a hodgepodge of grossness, but we don't need a Emmy cable there. We need we do need an Emmy cable there, so Okay, so another thing, we're going to need two more filters for fluid of the... Okay, let me just get this handled then. Bucket. Okay, I'll just do a, I'll just do a, a single bender. Bender is great. Bender is great. All right. Uh, integrated. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Okay. It's funny that I never automated this before. That's only become a real problem until just now. Okay, so let's pop over to our towers. We should have a free tower. Yep, there we go. All right, so let's get my screw drive, my wrench out. All right. Cable. Okay. And pop you in there. IV bucket maker. Okay, that should work. Now make the pattern not that look it all right all right we need the filter which i still need to make a pattern for anyway so that's good paper bucket boom
Okay. It's still making that other bucket, I mean filter. Did I forget to change the um, machine output? There we go. I did forget that. Okay. Uh, boom. Okie dokie. So we'll go back over here now. And we're going to say, we're going to get that off there. I don't think it's put anything in there, right? Or, uh, no, okay. So in here goes the mutagen, mutagen and out raw growth medium. I, we don't actually really need the out, don't we? Uh, mutagen. Did it forget? Where is it? Mutagen. Oh. There we go. Okay. So now we're good there. Now we just need the salt. So I guess we'll send off... I think it's like we can do 496, right? Wait, how much salt is coming back from these missions again? That's salt, Peter. Where's salt? Salt. Nope. Rock salt. Salt. Here we go. Uh, okay. It looks like it's six. Wait. 64. Okay. So maybe something like 248. I could probably optimize a lot of this. I don't know if we can get rid of integrated logic circuits, but anyway. Let's just go ahead and pop that down there. Okay, so this is probably going to take some time to even get any progress going on. So, might need to do a little pausey pause. Um, yeah, just get a big ass number on there, because why not? Although, let's see. Uh, let's go back to our terminal here. Excuse me. Um. What, what exactly is that being used for again? Hey, what? Okay, whatever, I'll just go to the terminal itself. Where is it? It's over there. I mean, that's not being used for too much. What is this making exactly? Sodium metaventanite? Are we even using this anymore? Probably are to some degree. Sodium, not that. Sodium metaventanite. Can I say that word? Um, what? I don't even think this is being used. Am I crazy? doesn't even have a recipe it's being used for anymore. All right. Well, in that case, I'll just, uh, I don't know, remove the salt from the terminal here. Sure. Um, okay. Let's see what else. I don't think I've upgraded the pack recently. I mean, I know I haven't, but like, I, I don't know. I don't know why that's the case. Maybe this was like a really, 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 really old update that happened. Okay, what is this doing? That's uh, making chlorine. No, wait, that's not making chlorine. Wait, what? Of 
crude rhodium residue. Oh, that's making rhodium salt dust. I'm not sure if I can outphase that yet or not. Rock salt. Rhodium salt, rhodium tetroxide, salt in for hydroxide, you need that, salt in for chlorine, for HCl, salt in for sodium potassium, I need that too. Hmm. Crushed, where is this going? Oh, uh, we still have the old setup here. Get rid of that there. Let's get rid of all this. And I can stay there. Do we have anything going in there? Okay. Salt. Okay, we are getting some salt now. So let's go back down to our stable reactor. And honestly, I should just make a point for this. Oh, I did. Okay, never mind. Um... Why isn't it getting salt? Oh, I didn't put that. I didn't set it up yet. Okay. Did it, did it. Wait, what? Oh, I didn't put the salt in there. That's right. Okay. Hey, there we go. All right. So this is going to take... Wait, what? How are we out of power? We shouldn't be. What give? You're not out of power. Maybe, I don't think this is going to be the case, but. No, that definitely wasn't it. Okay, what's going on here? Raw. Growth medium. Let's get rid of that sound. Yeah, I don't get it. That should be fine. Is this not powering in properly? What the hell? Oh, you know what I think it is? I think it might be the... Hold on. Yeah, that's why. Okay. There we go. That should fix it. Okay. <laughs> Forgot to change that output. I know I'd change the other one, but uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, that scared me for a bit. I was like, why the hell is this not working, man? Okay. So while that works, let's get a tank and a bus. It's going to take, what, 10 minutes anyway to get... Oh my gosh, my eye is bugging me. It's going to take 10 minutes to get a single craft. Of the raw growth medium, which, um, okay, four buckets. I just realized the time. Okay. I just wanted to check my phone for a second. All right, so there is all of this. Let's go down with that. Go to the under, or the tanks, rather. <clears throat> okay. Oh, got my throat. Okay, anyway. Um, boom. And there we go. We got our first frog growth medium. Yay! Okay. Um, bucket. I want to get a bucket of that raw growth medium. And since, actually, you know what? No, screw it. Oh, my throat. <coughs> Sorry about that. Ah, heater. So let's get a heater, and then we... No, it's not that heater. That's an arc furnace. Um, yeah, we'll get the heater crafted first, and then we'll get the raw growth... Uh, the sterile growth medium, and that will be our video thumbnail, so to speak. Heater.
Hmm. Oh, my eye is bugging the crap out of me. Stop it. We need to turn the lights on in my room. <sighs> okay. Oh, here we go. Take a drink. Take a sip of my drink. Mm. Eater. Okay. I'm going to pop in here. Plug that bad boy in. Okay, so the raw growth medium really just needs input output. So we are going to be content to just get a regulator a face or two rather. All right, regulator. Okay. And then for here, still need to plug that in and I still need to get another circuit import. Okay. And I'm just going to guess it's one. Yeah, okay. So there we go. Sterilized growth medium. And I want to make sure we mute that. And make sure that's output. That's going to go in here, of course, because we don't have a means to output it anywhere. Um, let's go tank. Get that. The boost. Get the boost for the boost. Right. Uh, actually, we'll just do this. We'll just grab. Boop. And boop. And boop. All right. And there we go. What's that doing there? Chicken. All right. Um, all right. Over here. Bing, bing, bada, boom. All right. So now we have our sterilized growth medium. And that is going to open the way for the wetware circuit boards. All right. Let's see here. So stem cells and wetware substrate. So stem cells... Each craft in an LUV chemical reactor takes five minutes, so it's probably a good idea to have more than one machine running. At least you get 128 from a single craft. Oh boy. Did we get bacteria going yet? I think we did, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. So bacteria and uh, the growth medium and eggs. And we get sludge back, so it's a good process. A good reprocessing system. Um, is this going to be a matter of, wait, we could do, wait, there's no, uh, there's no multi-block for this, isn't there? Yeah. There's the LCR, but that's not the reactor that we want. So we are going to have to have a couple of reactors here gosh I wish there was a multi-block reactor so we're probably going to do like five of these egg okay so we're going to have to do egg missions too okay, what's um what's the egg recipe I think that's tier sixes. Probably tier six. Wait, where's the tier six on this? I think it's tier six. Yeah, nope, that's not it. Yeah, there we go. Tier six. Okay, so that's tier six. And how many did we get from that mission? 32. Uh, that's a bit expensive, isn't it? What are we missing exactly? No, I can't be right. 
Is it really just Flint? Are you serious? No, wait, hold on. Hammer, block of Flint. See, uh, wait, gravel? Do we really not have Flint? We have Flint, but not enough. Uh. Okay. Where's my sieve system? Oh, here we go. So let's see. If I put this into a... Oh, it needs to go into the sifter, not anything else. Okay, wait a minute. That's not going to... Yeah, that's going right back into the system. Mmm... Okay, then I guess I can make a regular sifter and just pipe our infinite gravel into there, and that will be fine. But for the time being, I'm just going to let that run for a bit, and then egg, egg, five, six. You know, I'll let that run after I turn off, turn off the camera. Oh, shoot, we are way over time. Okay. So I am going to end it here. Next episode, we'll come back and we'll work on the wetware and the boards, the, the stem cells and the boards, rather. But uh, yeah, that is going to be an episode. I hope you did enjoy. There's a lot of stuff to do here. A circuit assembler, you say? Okay. Anyway, hope you did enjoy. I will see you all next time. That's all for now.